Okay, this is question one. Uh, it says Theo earned £20 one weekend. He gives £4 to his brother. Express £4 as a fraction of 20. So, nice and simple to start with. 4 as a fraction of 20 is written like that. Now that will get you a first mark because we've written a fraction. But it says give your answers in its simplest form. So let's simplify this. I'm going to simplify it. Fours going to the top once, and they go to the bottom five. So my answer is one fifth. Part B. It says here Theo gives six pounds to his mother. Express six pounds as a percentage of twenty. Well, the key point here is the percentage bit. Okay. So I'm going to write it as a fraction to start with. 6 over 20. Well, if I could get it as a fraction out of 100, that would be really easy to write as a percentage. So the denominator has got to get 5 times bigger. So the numerator has also got to get 5 times bigger. That means that it must be uh, 6 times 5 is obviously 30. So as a percentage, 30%. Now, that's four marks so far. It says Theo, and this bit was answered really badly. Theo spent the remaining £10 on bus fares and food. He spent £1.50 more on bus fares than on food. So if we think, some people did, if we got the uh, £10 and we split it in half, just to start with, because we're sharing between those things, it's a fiver or £5 equally. Now that doesn't work because it's obviously going to spend £1.50 more. So what some people did was saw that and go, ah, okay. So £1.50 more means that they must have spent £6.50 on bus fares. And then went ahead and put that answer. But that is wrong. Because obviously if they spent £6.50 on, on bus, they only spent three fifty on food and then this does add up to £10 but it's not £1.50 more it's actually £3 difference so that bit doesn't work so it can't be that so let's take that off so the way I thought about it was I split the £1.50 that it's difference here the £1.50 I also split that in half so to 75p so if I go 75p in each direction, I'll still be £1.50 apart. So that tells me that this one must be oops, £5.75 and this one must be £4.25. Now they definitely, uh, so this is the bus and this is food. Now they definitely add up to the one pound uh, fifty difference here, and the total between them is uh, five. It is ten pounds. So I split it, but I also split the difference, and then so therefore the answer we need to put in here is five pounds seventy. Okay.